Ebony has just released a new ground general. Now you're probably here because you want to know if he's any good or not. Well, right off the bat, I can say he is the best ground general. Now a few days ago, I did a ground general video reviewing all of the ground generals before he came out. I've run all of his numbers and compared them all of those, and I have all those stats for you if you're interested in them. And let's jump into those and take a look at them. Okay, so right here we have such a... We don't have any data on if he can take any of the skill books or not. But looking at his skill, I would assume that he can probably take all of them. His clause is the marching clause, so he can only be used in the attack, so that's something to keep in mind. Overall, his total skills for a full ascension, these don't include his skin or covenant. These are just the base ascension, base specialty, and attributes. He ranks second for attack. His defense is a little bit below average, but that's okay. And he is the highest in effective health. He also has a 12% march size capacity, which is very nice. That's a pretty decent number. Now, those are the stats. Let's see how they stack up when we look at effective numbers. We can see that this number right here is without the covenant, and this is with the march size book in the calculation. So if he can't take the march size for some reason, or in the assistant calculation, if he can't take the attack book, he's going to drop down in this ranking a little bit, but it's not going to change too much. Now, 56.8 billion extra damage. That puts him uh, far above anybody else. No, he's fourth, right behind Alexander, Luzon, and Ludwig for just the skin. So he's fourth in damage overall without the skin, but if you get the skin and you get the covenant, he becomes number one in overall damage, which if you're getting him to full ascension, I would assume you're probably getting the skin as well, and you're going to have the resources to get that, that uh, covenant. So realistically, he is number one for your main general slot at the full stats for attack. Now let's look at his survivability. I only ran the numbers on the T12 ground versus the T12 march because it doesn't change a whole lot across these boards as we showed in my ground generals video. So we're just looking at this one. Now... 66.9 rounds of combat, that puts him above anyone else, even a full Elise with her special, with her skin doesn't match compared to a such it with no skin and no covenant. When you throw the skin and the covenant on there, he's ab above everyone else by a decent bit, so he's a very tanky general overall. And you'll see that in all of these other marches too if you were to run the numbers on those. So we can see that he is, as a main general, Objectively, he's going to be the best that we have at the moment. Now, let's look at how he's going to perform as an assistant. Such that we can see that he gives us the most for attack. 55 and 75, pretty average numbers right there. Nothing too crazy. 6% march size, but remember, he does have an extra 5% march size from his covenant, which if you're running him as an assistant, you should be able to get the covenant eventually. So that's going to boost him in the ratings. Now, let's look at the effective damage for that. We can see that without, he's 20.7 for total damage, which ties him for a swing with a covenant. So he is number one for effective damage as an assistant. 25.2 if you add the skin and the covenant to that. So that's really high for an assistant. So that's good. Uh, let's look at his survivability as an assistant. 14.4 rounds of combat puts him above everyone else, even without the, the skin or the covenant. When you throw the skin and the covenant on there, he's above them by even more, so he's going to be the tankiest assistant. Overall, such it is going to be your best assistant and your best main general. Don't have any data yet on who he's compatible with, if there's any skill book issues with him, so we'll wait and see for that. But overall, I would say such it is a solid choice, whether you just get him or one copy of him and you want to use him as assistant, very solid assistant, highly recommend, or if you want a coin and you want to max him out and use him as your main ground general, excellent choice right there. And that's all I have for today, and I hope you all uh, found this video useful.